this has to be like some of the best terraforming I've ever seen in my entire life. Even the mush partitions look good here. Normally they just look like scary globs of, I don't know, mucinex, but here they actually look really good. Hello guys, welcome back to another island tour. Look at this flyover. Um, I was gonna tell you guys how blown away you're gonna be by this island, but I feel like you can already get a gist of that based on the flyover. So, let's go check it out. Um, I feel like this is probably gonna blow our minds. And we're here! Hello, Steven! He looks adorable in his little outfit um, and flower crown. I absolutely love it. Um, there's a lot of presents here, which makes me feel really guilty. <laughs> but, very sweet. Um, Steven is going to lead us around, which I'm really grateful for because... Did you guys see that flyover? I don't think I could do it myself. Um, do I have faith in myself that I could have done it alone? No. None whatsoever. A snowflake wreath? What? I didn't even know those existed. Iceberg flooring? Oh my gosh, what? Illuminated reindeer? These make me think of um, Harry Potter. I love them illuminated present oh my gosh she's giving me all the winter things what this is so sweet thank you steven pisces lamp soft serve lamp cheek him up oh my god wait is this what he's wearing oh yes because it's so cute a fairy dress oh, what wait I didn't know these existed. Ballet slippers. Oh my goodness, I look adorable. Let me take off my socks because like, you know, we don't want to be embarrassing. This is so cute. Thanks, Steven. Let's check it out, guys. Um, hello. So I originally toured this island during a dream suite st stream um, and I was just so blown away by it and I'm going to tell you what it reminds me of. Um, it reminds me of Avatar, the, the movie, not the show. Um, just feels like you're in a different world when you're here. Um, all the flowers, the star fragments, it's just so beautiful the way he decorated and the way everything's kind of glowing and illuminating the way is just so pretty. I mean, look at that butterfly up there. It looks like it's glowing. Oh, this is a cool pattern. Oh my gosh, that's really cool. Very abstract, I got Paca Pablo Picasso over here. This is so pretty. Um, so these are uh, star clocks turned around. Um, they kind of look like mini Nova lights. They're perfect to kind of mix up the sizes if you have like a fairy court island and you want to scatter some fragments around. Um, just make sure you turn them backwards so that you can't see the clock part and they work perfectly. Tulip surprise box. I love how we cut the bamboo. That is such a good look. A little lavender shop. Gosh, all the fairy circles too with the mush lamps. 
Oh, I see a farm up there. He did tell me to bring a ladder, so. What? This is so gorgeous. Oh my gosh, the white ones are like so, so beautiful. Look at the little geese. It's almost like they're in love. Oh my gosh, just a little outdoor fireplace. Nothing's playing, so you can hum to yourself as I often do. Uh, yeah, um, next up is a bubblegum KK cover. <laughs> um, create the scene for yourself. So colorful, but at the same time, it's like everything matches you know it's a lot of pinks and purples oh i see it's like a little harvesting area for all of your lavender and your crops i love the baby stumps those are so adorable yes to the baby stumps also i'm sure a lot of you guys know this but if you plant a tree next to another tree or a tree stump um it won't grow so you get this cute little sapling which looks really adorable for the farms this is incredible oh i didn't even notice that the silo was pink i love that he gave me the perfect outfit for this thank you so much steven you know my vibe so well oh this is so oh, oh my god Look how magical this little market is with the white garden wagon and the flower stand and all the cherry blossoms. Okay, his um decorating skills, like what the heck? Even the little cake shop. This island is so magical, you guys. So magical. Beautiful little picnic area. And Raymond, hey Raymond. I love how big the picnic blanket is. Oh, and he put the the cherry blossom parasol right here too, and it looks really good. Just like a big cherry blossom flower, hanging out, <laughs> doing things. And the iron bench here in white is just so perfect. And fairy like this is like the ultimate fairy core island i love the idea of scattering around star fragments like this like all over the island i would just be so worried people would come and take them from me oh look how floral this is oh my gosh i love okay this is so gorgeous Okay, so we have more of the star clocks and nova lights again. Oh my gosh, he must have wished on so many stars for these guys. With the crescent chair in the middle too. Oh my gosh. The illuminated reindeer that just always reminds me of Harry Potter. Um, and you have a nice little bench and a cozy blanket. That's like the perfect blanket for this island too because it's like a simple color but it's still a really beautiful pattern so it's not too overbearing i'm obsessed with over here this beach like oh my gosh it's just so overgrown and naturey like if you guys are stuck on your beaches just do something like this um like lots of flowers and weeds and hedges. Oh, is this the little library? So cute. Um, careful though, there's candles. There's candles right by the bookshelves. So, more of the insanely beautiful beach. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, a whole wedding area? 
Oh, I love the roses down the aisle. Like you throw flowers. Oh my goodness. Oh, and he used a lost item as a little blue journal up here. Like the guest book. So cute. Beach weddings though. 10 out of 10. Look how much like nature there is here. Like there are so many trees, so many flowers. Oh, I love this flower field. Yes, Steven, go off. Even the mush partitions look good here. Normally they just look like scary globs of, I don't know, mucinex, but here they actually look really good. I like how tucked in the house is too. And the Pisces lamp looks so beautiful. Oh, and a little picnic area. That is too cute. Is that a little pink balloon? Yes. The balloons are perfect decor for um, this style island, I think. Especially like the pink and yellow ones. This island is just like breathtaking. Like what do I even take a picture of for the thumbnail? Like I have no clue. I mean, by the time this video is up, I will have a picture for the thumbnail and I'm just as curious as you as to what I pick. <laughs> I love him waving the glow stick. It's like the best tour guide ever. He's like, yeah, we're here. Oh my God. Okay, wait, 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 let's try taking a picture of this. Boom. I bet that's gonna be the thumbnail. Oh my God, I lost him. This is why we can't have nice things. Oh my goodness. Oh, there he is. There he is. So pretty and glowy. Oh, I like how he did this. I find it so hard to decorate things that aren't just like front facing. So the fact that he put that um, bookshelf faced away from the camera and made it look good. Um, like, good job. And the hyacinth lamp is a perfect touch. Oh, little Dom. Little Dom. This is beautiful. Let's see what's playing. Nothing's playing. Well, I guess that's because you're supposed to play the music. Okay, the music stand is a very underrated item in this game, by the way. I love the brown ones. I think they're really cute. For those of you wondering, uh, it's a DIY. Look at this little mush garden! I love the log stakes as fences and all the flowers. Ooh, what is over here? Another illuminated Oh, this is his shop! Okay, okay. Illuminate me, Nooks. This is so magical. <gasps> is this a gnome? Is this a gnome picnic? They have eggs. Are they are they in cahoots with Zipper? Because I had more faith in them, you know? Illuminated snowflakes? Everything here is illuminated. How does he decorate like this? He even has the egg trees. This is one of my favorite um, creator of custom designs. I think they have the most gorgeous, gorgeous signs and stuff, but I never have room and it's very sad. Look at this view. I'm drinking my coffee instead of clapping. I'm just like, look at the moon in the background. It's not even like an Animal Crossing moon. It's like the game's moon. Like with the cherry blossoms flying about. Like no tomorrow. It's just so beautiful. 
all the colored flowers are so pretty. Oh my goodness. Oh, he has a blue balloon. Okay, but if you look down, like over there, look at this terraforming. It's like we're on a literal cliff. I mean, we are on a cliff, but you look down and there's like a ravine. This has to be like some of the best terraforming I've ever seen in my entire life. Imagine trying to navigate this island with controller drift. Oh my god, I would literally smash my window with my controller. Oh, a little bear picnic! That is so cute. I love how windy the path is to get up here too. This island is like a blessing. Like being able to walk on it. Like... There's just, there's stuff to see at every angle, every, every step of the way. There's just something. I can't even imagine, like, how he did something like this. I feel like he beat the game. This is just mind-blowing. And he made the island feel huge. Who is this little thing? Renee. Renee's Gemini? Well, I guess I'll let her into the club then because I love Geminis. I know, I know, come for me, but they're the best. Oh, I love how there's a campsite villager and it's like illuminated in the dark. Nintendo really spoiled us with graphics for this game. Especially compared to New Leaf. Like, oh my god, have you gone back to New Leaf after playing New Horizons and just been like, I really lived like this? Oh my gosh, look at the peaches! They're so juicy. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, they're so juicy. Um, I don't think that was supposed to come out of it, so I'll fix it. Don't want to ruin the garden with toddlers, I don't know. Look at all the mum cushions. Oh my goodness. The way the blue butterflies like glow in the dark, kind of, just... This terraforming is just a chef's kiss. Are you kidding me? How much QR space does this guy have? Look at this. This is like a, there's a there's a river on a river. Like Oh my goodness. He's like please for the love of god move out of my way. <laughs> Oh, look at the man by the moon. Very royal. This is incredible. Like, you thought this island couldn't get any better, and then we came over to this side. Judy would, is like in heaven here. How does he have so much room for QRs? Cute, a hidden little reading area on the on the rock. I, you guys are so creative. I always forget to decorate those areas. Audie, seeing Audie's house gives me literal war flashbacks. No, no. Wow. Oh my gosh. This is so cozy. I mean, thank God he's leading me. We would have missed half, half the island. Let's be real. A sweet little ravine. Is ravine just another word for river? I don't know. 
If I'm using the word ravine incorrectly and it's actually like a gulf or something, don't come at me, okay? I haven't studied up on my water definitions recently. This is beautiful. Oh my gosh, the moon. Yes. This is so beautiful. All oh, the way he's hidden by the tree. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's completely cutting out the island owner for me. Mm, I love this. Oh my gosh, he's the path on the beach and it looks so, so good. It looks very swampy. A little, a little place to dip your toe in. Oh my gosh, it's Audi. He's coming to taunt me. The large star fragments are so gorgeous. Oh my gosh, she literally... <gasps> no! She's blocking me. The way she's following me, like she literally knows I risked my life for her and failed. <gasps> A strawberry farm! Oh my gosh, how cute is that? With the little elephant? <laughs> Okay, I saw this from the cliff and I was like, oh my gosh, what is that? And it's mind blowing. Look at the pink tree. It looks like it's made of little pom poms. Hello, mister. I love all the artwork. I forgot to mention that the street lamps also look so beautiful at night when they're like glowing like that. Oh my gosh, this, I mean, there's just so much to like be in awe of. Like, I feel like you guys are just probably gonna delete your games after this and I might have to join you. I love the way he mixed in fruit trees too. Oh, is this his house? Oh my gosh, is it blue? It's hard to tell in the dark, but I think it is, and that is the cutest thing. I don't think I've ever seen a blue house. And the blue rose wreath. What? Oh my gosh. Is this like a band performance? This is so sick! Oh my gosh, there's even a vending machine for your, for, I really hope they have uh, the barbecue Lay's chips because those are my favorites. Oh, look at all the, the album art on the walls. That's such a good touch. Oh, how magical. Oh my gosh, this wallpaper. Oh, and the floor too. It's the floor movement for me. <gasps> the way that when you walk in the water, there's little footprints. I didn't realize that. This is so sick. Look at the purple humidifier. It's like he found the most magical looking items in the game and used like every single one of them. How am I allowed to step foot on this island? Steven, if you're listening, I'm so impressed right now. What? Oh my gosh. It's raining. Is this like a mushroom growing room? Oh. See, what's confusing about this is that it's pouring out. You know, we're getting soaked. But the fire is still going. So I see that there's lots of magic happening in this room on this island. <gasps> okay. Okay, imagine having this bedroom. What the heck? You can make a little dinosaur in the corner. 
not me surrounded by all of the most beautiful items in the game, but focusing on a beginner DIY of a clay dinosaur. I feel like I made something just like that in second grade and my parents still have it. It's just so good. It's so beautiful. Even the blue chair, like, I just, the cute furniture set was like perfect for this house. Especially in the blue color. So pretty. Whoa! Oh my gosh! <gasps> Look at the wind blowing the plant. Oh my gosh! Oh my god, someone hold him down! He's flying! Wait, this is the coolest plant shop ever! Are you joking? How does this look so... This has to be one of the best plant shops I've ever seen. I'm obsessed. Oh my gosh. The way the Cosmo showers are watering the tulip surprise boxes, like, ugh, so good. I would love to live in this island. It's just so magical. Like, nothing could go wrong here. Wow. Oh my goodness. Steven is a mastermind. Um, obviously, he deserves all of the recognition right now. So if you guys are not following him on Twitter, go check him out. Go tweet him. Send him pictures of kittens. Tell him how much you love his island. I'm so blown away.